Alright everybody, it's Doug here again. I thought I'd make a short video about my Neon Sign power supply and the capabilities of it. As you can see, it's not a transformer. Actually it is. It's a, it's a flyback transformer, but it's got a bunch of driver electronics, so it's not this big monolith. Subsequently, it's not a very high current power supply, and there are some drawbacks because it was built with a GFI unit in it. But um, Anyway, it's an Evertron model 2610. Um, input uh, 120 volts at 2 amps, output plus minus 5.5 kilovolts uh, at 27 milliamps at 20 kilohertz. So, uh, I have this switch, this is the pole chain for it because it was meant for a neon sign. Uh, I have it wired permanently on and I've also disabled the GFI so that uh, it used to turn itself off automatically and have to be reset by pulling the chain um, if it was open circuited, which would be, which is bad because it would have to start it basically short circuited um, and then open up the gap uh, and it would, you know, it wouldn't start the gap by itself. So it was useless for making a Jacob's Ladder or whatever, which is what I originally got it for. But anyway... Uh, I've also disabled the ground fault interrupt, which uh, when there's more than a certain uh, amount of current dumped to ground, it'll automatically shut off, because this is plus and minus 5,500 volts relative to ground. Um, so I get a total of 10 kilovolts across the electrodes, but I only have to insulate to 5, or 11. Yeah. So anyway, I'm going to show you here with my uh, electronic caliper. This gap here is more than, it'll jump this more than easily, but and I have it set a little bit closer together than usual so I can... Uh, show you how it will restrike itself when you blow on it, but this is um, 0.327 inches, about, so, um, pretty respectable gap. I'll set the camera down and turn it on, you'll see it easily jump that gap. See, there's the arc, as you can clearly see, and if I blow on it, clearly, uh, not going to go out. So that's what I hope to put right in front of the atomizer of my uh, burner so that I can uh, use that to ignite the oil like a commercial oil burner. If I'll focus on the arc. That'd be great. Oh well. So that's my neon power supply.